welcome back to another video I'm gonna be doing my kitchen counter today um, I absolutely hate it but here we go this is all the product that you would need for this pro for this project and it's very important for you to get the primer let's say oil base very very important and the scissors I'm gonna use to open the top and that popsicle steak that's what I'm gonna use to stir it um, once I open the can and you can use any sponge of your choice um, the one from the Dollar Tree sponge that you use to wash your dishes it doesn't matter you can even use um, a paper towel you know scrunch it up I, you know whatever nothing specific I'm just gonna be cutting this in four pieces and um, I did cut it smaller when I got started and I'm using four color um, acrylic paint gray white brown and black and I'm using a paper plate to put the paint on it definitely want to have gloves on And you want to have two roller because it um, the primer is very thick um, it's very thick so you want to use um, two roller after you're done you want to toss it oh, so here I go mixing the primer and then I what I'm gonna do is just Pour it on top and just, I'm just gonna pour straight out of the can onto the counter and a roll. Yes, and that paint um, roller just kept coming off, so I did um, change it because that, that was very annoying. Okay, so now I finished and I'm gonna start with the first paint, which is a black one. Put you don't need a lot. Like so. I'm gonna dab the sponge in it and the paint. I'm gonna like dab it on the side of the, the um the paper plate so I can get some of the excess off and I'm going to directly put it onto the counter so completely dry no specific order you just go as you could just tap 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 until you're satisfied and I'm satisfied with how it turned out so that was it and I went ahead and did all of the counters The next one I'm going to use is the brown. I'm going to do the same process, dab it in and take some off. And like I said earlier, you just you're just making pattern as you go. Is no in, in no order.
and that's how it turned out. Next, I'm going to use the white. Next I'm going to use the last color which is the gray and I'm using the, um, the sponge that I used to wash my dishes for the last one. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my page um, and I have more videos like this that you guys can watch and I'm sure you will enjoy and thank you so much for the support and it should look something like this once you're done with all your applying all your colors Now it's time to get it all shiny and protected. So you want to mix that up. And I'm going to be doing the same method that I did with the primer. I'm just going to um, pour it on. But first, I'm going to use the paintbrush and go around the edges that the roller is not going to be able to get to make sure I get everything. For the first comb, I'm going to let it sit and dry for about an hour, and then I'm going to put a second coat on. This is the finished product. I hope you guys enjoy watching it. I lost the original footage that I had when the counters was completely empty. But um, you guys can still see it. I really appreciate y'all watching this video. And see you next time. Thank you.